name is Alero Kourudus and I'm the co-producer of this amazing, very amazing series titled The Amamalus. Well, one thing that I really love about being um, a part of this photo shoot is it's, it's more like an extension. Oh, the photographer is amazing. It's been um, great working with him. Been bringing out the best picture that would narrate the story of the characters with pictures. I'm Joan Bafey and I'm the CEO for Jewish Fashion Consulting. This is the first time I'm working with this crew. The makeup, the hair, the photographer and his team. Wow! It took a lot of courage, a lot of boldness. We, we went very African with the photo shoots, very, uh, very flamboyant, very bougie. Amazing casts. We're pushing the boundaries in Nigerian filmmaking. Like Um, having to work with um, over 50 cast and crew members, wow. So basically my character Ehi is a psychologically repressed uh, woman, young woman. She's a strong businesswoman. I play Dr. Oluchi um, in The Anomalous and she's um, a psychologist. She's a therapist. She helps people through their traumas and through whatever psychological, you know, mental issues that they may be going through. Uh, well, first of all, um, the story Anomalous, it's, um, it's more like a story that tackles different issues that happens in Africa, in families, in every area. And um, it's very interesting because um, these are issues that we all can relate to. You guys don't know what is about to hit you. Like, I am serious. This TV series is amazing. This is something that has never, never... Now, I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to make a molehill. This is fact. This has never, ever been told anywhere in Hollywood. Oh yeah, so Tito is this naive village girl. She's not really a village girl, a town girl that's needy. She's 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 like the girl that needs to be loved that's in love with a guy that doesn't really have so much of her time because he does not have money. Uh, yeah, so it was it was a roller coaster of emotions, you know, for, for Chinedu because then uh, he, he loved what he was doing, but this is something that's considered a crime, you know, especially in this part of the world. And how does this pan out at the end of the day? You know, he, he visits a, a therapist and tries to understand the level of, of crime he's, he's uh, been into and at the same time trying to know for sure uh, whether there was really anything wrong in it. I mean, falling in love with someone that closely um, related by blood. The concept behind the photo shoot basically was to portray the same thing we already have in the movie, but then to give it a twist so that at least we could, uh, uh, you know, better pass the message in terms of still pictures uh, as opposed to waiting for uh, the trailer of the movie. Uh, so we're, we're trying to create the characters in still pictures, uh, which is one of the things that I'm really good at. And uh, uh, watch out for the pictures, they're going to be amazing. <laughs> Okay, so um, the look for the shoot basically was just something nice, a pretty look, something really regal, not too dark, but the makeup actually spoke about their characters, the different characters in the movie. So the makeup was like a reflection of the characters they played in the movie. 